It's only been out here a couple of minutes. Not many casts yet. We'll take them. I'd say a uh, good pound at least. Look how you got yourself hooked, buddy. That ain't too bad, I guess. Across the mouth, but it's coming out. Just gotta get this thing around. There we go. Well, that was pretty quick to get you. <laughs> Can't work my phone with a wet thumb. Oop, oop, oop. No, don't call me right now. So here we are, we're at Whiten's Pond again, the same place we normally go, however, we're on the other side of the road, like the road's right in front of me, on the other camera, um, where the big pond is. And this guy, oh, there we go. Oh no, no, I do not want kilograms, hold on. There we go. Nope, 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 wrong unit. Ah, there we go. All right, one pound, six ounces. That took a while to get there. I don't like it when the units change for some reason. Anyway, we haven't been out here long and this guy bought a bit off the, uh, the same crankbait that we like to always use on my uh, spinning rod. And um, he's a healthy looking fish. He's been out for a while. So show you the mouth and put it back in. Thanks buddy. Thanks for watching guys, have a great day. See how many more of your friends I can find here. Oh, we just had a bite. Cool. I think he got a bit of that hook, so he probably isn't going to come back for it. But I will throw over there again. Kind of. Got to get used to using a spinning rod again. I hardly ever use them anymore. Yeah, I didn't think he'd bite again. We'll throw another one just to make sure. Probably end the video after that one to, to start a new one for a new catch. Don't have much time today. Got out of work a little later than I wanted to. Wasn't gonna come out, but then just came out anyway so it's been worth it just from the one bite oh. <laughs> we are on i felt some really quick taps and i was like that feels like a panfish and um then it was just like slack so nothing it is a panfish it is a red breast look at that guy huh You're not a red breast. I couldn't even tell, but you're a very blue colored pumpkin seed. Well, just a few minutes later, I feel what feels like a panfish bite. So I reel it in and I keep feeling little tugs, but I can't quite figure out what it is. Well, welcome to like a, oh, you just, shook the water right in my eye 
behind my glasses. Thanks, man. All right, here you go. It's a pumpkin seed. Not a very brightly colored pumpkin seed, but we are in the fall, so anyway, I'm gonna put him back. He was caught on the same crankbait. No business trying to get it, but hey, he tried anyway. Gotta give him credit for that. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day. On. It's been a while, and we've caught three fish. We've caught three species. We got a bass, 1.6 pounds, a bluegill. Uh, didn't bother weighing that guy. Um, he wasn't a big one. I've actually caught some pretty decent ones of those, actually. And now... How's that picture? Perfect. We've got ourselves a pickerel, as you could just see on the camera. Hey, guys. It's been a while. We, um... Went all the way down the pond and it came back up. Now we're on our third fish we just caught. So we got three fish for three different species. Our first fish was a bass at one pound, six ounces. Nice bass. And then we got a bluegill. And you can hear this guy shaking over to your, uh, to my right, your left. We got a, a pickerel, a decent sized one. He seems to be one of the calmer pickerels that I've ever seen. Um, that doesn't make him calm by any means. There we go. Oh man, I messed up your nose a little bit. I am so sorry, man. I do not mean to cause you harm, I promise. Ooh. All right, ooh, ooh, ooh. Stay, stop shaking, you're gonna make it worse. But anyway, I'm gonna finish getting this guy. I got his nose pretty good, unfortunately. There's no blood kind of coming out of it, so he'll be okay. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day. Easy, easy. <laughs> oh God, you stink. Thanks for, for biting. I'm sorry about your nose, but man, you stink. That's why I release them with pliers while holding the bait. They all stink to me. Well, four casts later, and we're on. He's giving me a pretty good fight here. I'm guessing he's a bass. I hope he's a bass. He's a bass. There he is. He ain't done yet? Okay, okay. I'll give you a little bit more, but don't go under my boat. Tell me when you're ready. I'm going to pull you over here, though. Yeah, keep fighting me if you want. This guy might be pushing two pounds. Nah, he's not pushing two pounds. He might be 1.6, just like that last one. Ooh, should have done that a little more careful. That could not have ended well easily for me. All right, guys, here we are. We just caught that pickerel about four casts ago. And um, this is actually almost exactly where we caught our first fish, where we are now. So why not let this be the same spot that we catch our fourth fish that is in kilograms again. And one pound, four ounces. So he's not the same fish, but he's uh, he might be the other fish's little brother. So, I haven't actually looked at him yet. He gave a really good fight. I I would have believed that he was really, really heavy. Look at that right there. Do you see that? I don't know if that's from a hook before or not. But yeah, I think that's from a hook. He just got a bad hook into his gill before. That wasn't from us. We got him in the lips right where you want a bass to actually bite. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I'm going to go for a little bit while longer. See what I can get. Have a great day. Thanks, buddy. I hope that heals up. Oh, wow, you were fast. Oh, that was fun. We're not done yet. This is not the same crankbait we've been using. This is, it's another rattle trap. It's the three quarter ounce and it actually has a different color pattern. Some gold, some black, some translucent along with the orange. 
and you can actually see the rattles in it. It's pretty neat. I do have the half ounce version of this. When you move up to the three quarter ounce, the debate increases in size, uh, almost double actually. Uh, we're starting to get some raindrops. I didn't know it was supposed to rain. I'm not going to check the radar while I have a lure in the water. I was thinking another good 45 minutes I have. Um, however, this rain might change things. It is increasing. Let's see here. Radar. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, we're good. It might be some later, but this isn't even registering on the radar. 